Hi guys, this is Rishali, and I think I've come across like a really cool way to make these amazing dynamic mind maps and integrate them with your note taking app. I personally use Notion, so I think if you're someone who's really like into structuring these notes or apps, you're really gonna like this video. Uh, just a little disclaimer before I get right in. I've kind of tried and created this content for my fellow students because I think they'll be able to relate a lot more to it. But I'm keeping it open because I think a lot more people will be able to benefit from it. So having said that, um, any time in the video, if you feel like there are keywords such as Stoa and Misi coming up, just scroll through the description of the video, and I'll make sure to like link as many references as possible. Okay, so let's dive right in. I'm gonna start uh, with this note making app called. obsidian right and if you haven't heard about it yet i am sure your life is going to take like a really good turn so on the left you can see that there are some you know just you know random notes and um i'm just completing the sentence i'm saying all of would make a really great student to under double brackets like heart toll is I'm going to double click on that and bam we have created a new note and its backlinking is why people call it the second brain right because if you just hover over to this open graph view and click on it you will see that an instant connection has been made between Olaf and Ikhar Toll because I just established that node and what this does is if I'm just randomly like noting down my thoughts and in hindsight because of the backlinking i'll be able to connect the dots and see if i can build on top of it but now let's say if i want to like understand my work priorities and all and i want to take like the driver seat into controlling this you know connecting the dots then how do i do it that's where the second part of the video like the mind maps come in so i came across the software called miro where you can just create like really cool mind maps and i've created this one for the use case of you know how do i structure my work priorities and i've used the misi principle here all of those from stoa will know what misi is all of those you don't, who don't i'm just going to link in another video where you can figure out what the framework is uh so you know i said that what are my operational priorities management principles and you know structure the rest of the notes accordingly now how, how do i come back to this right like every time i want to build on top of this mind map do i come back to the website This is where the integration kind of comes in. Like Notion is something that I use for, you know, I'm new to it, but I'm starting to use it because I really like it. If I want to integrate my board where I created the mind map, I just have to type like the Miro plugin here and embed the link. So let's go and do that. I'm just gonna create the link and add. Cool. Um. I think we should be able to see the board and not the middle, but okay, cool. There it is. And if I just click on see the board, you will see the mind map that I've created, right? Okay, so now I talked about like creating the backlinking effect by like establishing more control into it, right? How do I do that? That's where the hack sort of comes into play. I've created the same board previously. where i've just sort of you know um backlinked it to the notion files like i've made another file for research and development in notion and if i want to like just put down notes under what all should i be doing in research and development until the time that i create those notes i can do that right and i've created like the same database to structure all my notes right here so what notion really does is So if I want to sort of categorize the information into different filters I can do that in like different views right the table gallery calendar timeline what not but I am someone who really you know uh, can understand in a pictographic format and I am able to build on top of it easily so this is where it personally helps me and I think uh, creating this environment where like the, there's a super easy accessibility of like backlinking into mind maps to your like note making app that was the game changer for me and um i thought of sharing this with all of you so that's pretty much it from my end and um if you like this concept and you know just give me a thumbs up and uh, 
yeah if you are able to sort of use this use case somewhere just let me know in the comments below and i'd really be glad to hear that those are cool all right thanks